Hey everybody, Dr. Seth here. Uh, people always ask me, you know, what do you, what, what do you take to keep yourself healthy? Uh, I make it a big part of what I do to work on my own health because I feel like I owe it to people that I'm trying to help keep healthy uh, to do the same thing. Uh, conveniently enough, I carry those things that that I use because they're the things that I trust. And uh, you know, so so there we go. Um, the first one I'm going to talk about is this product, Pro Omega 2000D. Okay? I take this for a, a number of reasons, uh, but in the main, you know, this is a, a clinical grade uh, preparation of omega-3 fatty acids, very high in DHA, uh, you know, and, and, and EPA, uh, which are you know, which are types of omega-3 fatty acids. Uh, the important thing to keep in mind when we're talking about omega-3s, I feel like omega-3s were the uh, you know, we're, the, we're kind of the, the hot supplement a while back, and people have dialed back on thinking about that now. Um, and nothing could be worse than that, uh, because essentially, when you when you when you're talking about omega threes, one thing that's important to hold in your mind is that they're an essential fatty acid. Um, and I feel like that's a that's a term that that bears some explaining. Essential means you don't make it. So, essentially. Essential means that it's as important to you as, as a vitamin, like vitamin C. You don't make vitamin C, you need to eat it, or your teeth fall out and you die, okay? Um, with, with omega-3s, you need to have an intake of this stuff because you essentially can't make it. Uh, it's important to make, to make the coatings of the, of the wires in your brain, the neurons, so that they fire off correctly and we don't cause all kinds of problems. It's key in controlling inflammation, heart health, vision, all things that we really like to have. Um, why is it connected to all those things? Because you could basically view it as an essential vitamin. It's needed to be healthy, and it's absent from our factory farm food. Um, those things are fed, fed grains which are high in omega-6s and absent of omega-3s. If the animals don't eat it, they don't make it either. They're supposed to be getting it from grass and other things that, that pastured animals would get, or wild game would get, or wild fish would get by eating lots of plankton and eating lots of little fish, right? Um, our modern diet is, is nearly void of these things, so we gotta take that. At the extreme end of deficiency for this stuff, we start seeing a, a lot more incidents of mental illness um, you know, and that can range from mild things like depression to, you know, to, you know much more, uh, you know, to, uh, to much more serious conditions. Uh, and at extreme deficiencies, we, we start seeing, you know, violent crimes uh, and that type of thing. An unhealthy brain does unhealthy things, sometimes to other people. I don't want that for myself or really for anybody else around me, but, you know, I, that's, why I, that's why I take this product and, and I, I ensure to take the best on the best, the best of the best. That's why we carry it here. So another thing that that I take on a daily basis, and there are a whole lot of them, but this is my core group of stuff. Right, I don't want to overload you with things. This is kind of essential, gotta have it kind of stuff. Um, I take magnesium, but not just any magnesium, because if you're taking magnesium oxide or cheaper forms, you might as well just be flushing your money down the toilet. Um, best bioavailable form that, that I'm aware of, magnesium lactate. Uh, the importance of taking magnesium uh, is that, you know, is that it's needed for more than 800 different biochemical processes in your body. That's a lot. Uh, it's especially crucial for a lot of proper functioning of the nervous system. What does proper, what does that mean, right? Well, one of the hardest things that your nervous system does is keep you at rest. It's harder to stay at rest than to all over the place. In fact, we see that with kids that are struggling with things like, like you know, attention deficit hyperactivity disorder and that type of things. That if their brain is, dis, is in a dysfunctional state, it's harder to stay at rest. It's harder to stay under, under control. Uh, so things like jumpy legs uh, at night, things like, uh, you know, like, or, you know, disturbed or difficult sleep, you know, all those types of things, uh, magnesium can often help. Uh, so it's not for anything specific except that it's just it's a necessary mineral that your body needs that unfortunately is not contained in your typical commercial fertilizer. So it's not going back into the soils when it's so foods that you're eating that should have it may not have it anymore because it might be completely depleted in that factory farm that it came from. Um, you know they put all they're putting
putting back in the soil is, is nitrogen, potassium, and phosphorus. Good old NPK. That's it. Uh, so if your mag if the magnesium is running low, you're not going to get it. Um, you know, so, so this is something I make sure to have because even uh, myself, I work. You know, I try to grow my own food. I, I put you know I put up some salt in the soil to make try to make sure that there's magnesium in the food. I buy a lot of my vegetables locally whenever I think of it or get the opportunity. Uh, but I still do this for insurance. The next thing I'm going to talk about uh, is is this this product that I take called Greens First. It's concentrated superfoods, um, juiced and, and dried at a low temperature to retain all their all their nutrient integrity, like broccoli, like kale, like spirulina, with the blue green algae, uh, beets, all kinds of things. Uh, the the recommended serving contains eight servings of, of these vegetables uh, you know for just swallowing a few capsules in a day uh, I know that they you know, the, the recommended daily allowance is like two or three or, or something like that that's the minimum required to keep you from getting sick that's the same way it is with vitamins hundred percent of vitamin C isn't the amount that you need to keep you vibrantly healthy it's the minimum to keep you from getting sick so what we want to do is not just be not sick, we want to be vibrantly healthy, uh, or at least that's my goal for myself and anyone else that I have come in contact with. Um, so that's why I use this product uh, on a daily basis. Um, and the thing that really got me going on seeking out a product like, like this was, a, was a, a book that I bought based on seeing a, a TED talk by Dr. Terry Walls, MD. Uh, she came down with MS. Uh, and she's you know, recorded in this book and in her um, uh, in her TED talk on the same topic, how she went about reversing that process for herself. And she did it largely through diet, seeking out nutrient dense as opposed to calorie dense foods. Because even though she's an MD herself and had access to some of the most respected and best uh, resources in, in the field, uh, you know, the, the top of the top colleagues, she was just, she kept, continued to decline and became wheelchair bound. Uh, when she seeked, when, when she sought out a, a cleaner diet and improved health, uh, you know, through taking better care of herself and intaking ungodly amounts of, of vegetables, um, she got better. She's in full remission and it's an amazing story. Uh, I know in my life, people suffering with MS, um, and uh, you know, I wouldn't wish it on anyone, especially not myself. Um, it's a, uh, which, which reminds me of the other thing I didn't mention about this Pro Omega 2000 D product is that it also contains vitamin D. Uh, we have a much stronger incidence of, of MS, which is multiple sclerosis, sclerosis here in the north. Uh, there are many experts that think that that's because we get less sunlight, therefore we're not making as much vitamin D. Vitamin D, while it's important for bone health, is also important for health of the immune system. An unhealthy immune system does incorrect things, like attacking your own self. Uh, in the case of MS, it's, it's attacking the, the myelin of the nerves. Uh, so, so just getting a little bit of a, a quality source of a vitamin D, also very important. Last thing on my list of, of things that I make sure to take every day just for the, the maintenance of my health uh, is, is something called Turmeric Fort from, from uh, um, uh, MediEarth, which is an offshoot of Standard Process. Um, this product is, you know, well, it's got turmeric in it, right? So it's got the, it's concentrated turmeric, which is, which is uh, you know, with, with additional ingredients of, of fenugreek fiber extract to increase the potency by about 25 times. It's really amazing. It's a super duper amazing inflammation fighter. So many of the problems that we have that ult that plague us as life move goes on and on, um, you know, in, in modern life, are due to rampant inflammation, uh, heart disease, rampant inflammation causing causing damaged cholesterol to stick to the inside of your arteries, um, like chronic pain, again, inflammation. Uh, you know, IBS, you know, or, or other digestive disc with difficulties, uh, inflammation. Um, you know, inflammation is coming from toxins in the foods, un unhealthy or, or nutrient-poor foods. 
stress. You know, the, the, the modern life is just a very inflamed life. Uh, even someone like me who works really hard to stay away from these damaging things, I can't tell you that I'm always successful at it. So I want a heavyweight in my corner like turmeric fork to make sure that I'm, I'm any baseline inflammation outside of the normal that I have uh, is, is taken care of. Inflammation is good. If you have a cut and it turns red, you know, it, it, that inflammation is fighting off the bacteria and making it so that you heal and, and that everything works well. That's a normal ad, uh, uh, application of inflammation, short-term healing. But when inflammation is going on constantly in your body instead of for a short period of time for a specific purpose, generalized constant chronic inflammation will tear you apart in a whole host of ways. Uh, so, so those are the things that I take on a, on a regular basis. Again, there's a whole lot more. Uh, I might break into these things specifically on a future video. Uh, just to go a little bit deeper because this may not do them complete justice, uh, but at least you got an idea. This is what I do. Um, if you look at me and say, boy, I'd like to be as healthy as that guy, um, you know, or, or you know, whatever it is that you may be thinking, um, you know, that's what I do. So, so now you know. We carry these things here. Happy to get them for you. Uh, but if you're nowhere near here or, you know, or, or, or what have you, you know, at least now you know you can get these things, right? Um, thanks a lot for watching. Yours in health, over and out.